Hello ladies and gents, welcome, it's fantastic to have you here. Today I've got this little box that I turned two years ago. It's one of my early turnings and I want to make it better for a long time. I kept it as a reminder how I turned before and I feel like it's been just sitting there and it's even ugly to look at, you know. <laughs> it's a nice wood and I haven't done justice to the wood. Um, this wood used to be a living organism. So it deserved to be at least pleasant to look at. Because it's not the wood's fault that it, that it looks like that. It's my fault. And that was when I started. So it's also a good reminder to those of you who who watch me. And maybe you're a beginner. That you shouldn't be too hard on yourself. You know. My project you see now I make. It's after two years of turning. So... That's what I was making before. So, if you're making the same thing, you know, be proud of it. You know, you've done something, and you should be proud. But when you get better, I I feel like it's best to go back and give yourself another challenge by improving what you made. I think that. That's better way at better way of looking at it than keeping it as a reminder. You know, change it because it's still gonna be your creation. Change it and make it look better according to your skill. You know, at the particular time. You know, when you're better and you feel like you can improve on that piece, then go back and improve it. So let's try and improve this one. Um, it's a nice tight fit for that time, but look at that. <laughs> I burnt it when I was parting it off. So, uh, but we're not gonna touch the inside. The inside, I'm surprised it's hollowed enough. And it's hollowed to that depth, so it's, it's no good making a recess at the bottom. I don't want to ruin this space. But we can change the outside of it. Putting it on the chuck and in expand. And then have it gripped on like that to change the lid. So let's get started.
I just finished buffing it. As you can see, uh, it made a lot of difference to how how it was before. And you might ask, how come it was darker uh, when you started? That's because back then I was using uh, my own made friction polish, French friction polish, and it was the garnet version, so it d distorted the grain texture, made it a little bit darker. Now it's uh, how it should have been finished. I hope you liked it and um, if you agree with what I did uh, let me know in the comments below and if you don't also let me know why. I think it's a good way to improve and show yourself that you can change what you made before. It's not perfect because I couldn't change in between there but it's also uh, that those little things is also a reminder but it did change a lot and I'm happy with it I also lasered the bottom as well with uh, my laser printer I hope you enjoyed it Thank you for watching and uh, I'll talk to you on the next project.